Hey guys, what's up everyone? Hi, how y'all doing? We're going to show you how to catch a high mirror. And we're here waiting for him right now. Go ahead and face towards... Yes. <laughs> we're on Wee Fishing Resort and uh, with the regular Wee. And we're catching the high mirror today. Yeah. Now, as we showed on previous videos, if you're too far out from the land, that can break your line. So I'm hoping I'm not too far out from the land that we can go ahead and catch him. Yeah, he better not get away. I He's not that. going to get away this time. I don't plan on that. So hopefully he'll start bouncing into that land real quick here and start bouncing back. But yeah, last night we did book club. Yes, we did. That was fun doing book club. It's always good to read the Bible with your children. Yeah. That's what we really enjoy and doing. And yeah. our Bible. And your, or your parents if you're a kid. Our Bible um, book club um, walkthrough, our Bible walkthrough was almost done. Uh-huh. And um, there will be... No more recording book club. But we will be doing book club, that's for sure, because me and Jazz do book club almost every day. It's, a, it's important that we stay uh, rooted and grounded in God's Word, because that's what we base our lives on. Right, Jazz? Right. See how he's bouncing into the land and bouncing back towards us? That's yeah. what we want. He's going to get tired, and then I'll start pulling them in. It's going to take a little time, though. But that's exactly what we want. I'll show you where we are, guys, when we get through catching them. So you know where to come when you're playing. And we're at Canaan Lake. That's the location we're at. You have to earn the right to come to Canaan Lake. You can't just automatically buy a weed fishing resort and come straight to Canaan Lake. It's got to earn that, but after you earn it, yeah, you can come here and get it Yeah, you earn it at Tidal River, yeah. I believe that's You earn it, it at Tidal River. Yep. I First, believe. all you got to do is just go to the normal lake, and then right. the, just do a um, river. Then you earn Tidal for the, that lake, and then you go to Tidal and you can earn a cable lake, correct. That's right. Yeah. Guys. You I can earn two places, Coco River and Tidal River. At Dual River Lake, that's correct. And they're both on the pier out there by the fishing license guy. We got two right here. I'm going to try to catch this one and go after the other. If I have time for a minute. See, well, these fish are so big that they can break your line. So you have to be very careful to be close to the land when you catch them. If that boat bit my hook and was able to swim to the middle of the lake, there's no way I'd catch them. They'll break my line. Even though I got the best tackle and lure in the game that I'm using right now, they can still break it. And they do quite routinely. He's not tired yet, so. He's going to get tired soon, though. He's starting to get tired. Then he'll start coming in, and we'll be out of real a minute. I would keep between the yellow and the orange with him. You don't want to get too far into the red, and you definitely don't want it to get too far into the blue. Maybe a little bit into the green. So, yeah, um, all we got to do is just um, find our phone stand, and then... When we find our phone stand, maybe we'll get back to doing two players. Yeah, that would be good. But for now, um, we're doing one player. And how you do two players on this game is it don't start off and let you select two players. But when you start fishing, you just get another remote. And, and you can and you can pick which character you want to be on the computer. That's right. You can be the dad, you can be the big brother, you can be the little brother, you can be the big sister, little sister. Yeah, you or the mom. Want. Or the mom. 
And you, yes, you do pick that out on the computer where you can check the fishing stats and all that stuff in the, in the motel rooms and resorts. I wouldn't get too far on the red because you could lose the fish. And that would be very frustrating at this time because we've been trying to catch this fish for three days. The good thing about fishing resort is no matter how bad you do on one day, you always get another chance. That's the same thing in real fishing. You know, you might have a bad day. But what, if we, what if we be stuck on this episode forever? We won't. We got him on the line and he's coming in. All right, we're going to catch this fish this time. See, we to have to catch bit. this fish this time. We are. Look, it's right in front of you. <gasps> wow! I'm a hook. I'm the one holding the camera, and Dad's the one playing. Yes, I am. And um, we caught. Two subscribers of Taylor Galvin. We appreciate both our subscribers. If you like this video, please hit like on the uh, comments page and you can subscribe if you'd like to. We want to do some more. Uh, we might be almost through with our one Bible, children's, children's Bible story Bibles, but we got others we can read. We're going to keep on doing book club, I think. I know Jane said we're almost through with it. We got some more Bibles we can use. So we're going to enjoy doing those episodes too. And we'll do some video games like this. It'll all be something family oriented. We're never going to do anything that you can't watch. Yeah, or maybe, or, or maybe we'll do four players if we can buy two more controllers. Okay. And buy some new batteries for them. I think we already got the batteries that's in the door. Just had to put them up because, you know, we have people coming up. Gotta clean up. You know, even dads and moms have to clean up. You know, the song you used to sing. Clean up, clean up. Everybody clean up. Yep. This Start fish is so long to catch. And it's the hardest fish in the world. Not the hardest. There's actually another one in this lake that's just a little bit harder. But it's like the third hardest, I'd say, or fourth hardest. You mean and that fish is easy? You just have to know his skills? Know, and you have to know how. You have to know yeah. how to do it. Once yeah. you know how to do it, you can do it. And it can be easy. It can be a lot easier than when we made it this time, yes. Yeah, it's an easy fish. You just need to know it, it's a tax. Uh-huh. And you got to know how to attack it. How to come at it. You can't come at it just straight at it. It'll swim away and disappear and never come back again. So we got it down to 46 feet. So he's coming in. It's tired now. He's like, I'm tired of fighting. All we're doing is reeling the rock. He's trying to swim Wait against. till it turns green. You don't want me to lose it, huh? Yeah. You learn to be cautious. And that's something you learn in this game, to be cautious. Especially in uh, lure fishing, not lure fishing, in uh, float fishing. You got to be cautious. Float fishing? Yeah, when you have the float in the line, when you got bait on the line. Yeah, so you... But lure fishing, you have to be a little bit more aggressive. Because you're moving around the bait, your lure trying to attract the fish. But in this type of fishing, no, you got to be really, really patient. Got him. It's over. All right. Got you. Jeez. Who want to take a picture of him? Jeez, it took us for A new record. 
Bonus thousand points. It took us forever to catch that stupid fish. Yeah, but we got him. Okay, so that's how you catch a hot area. Now, let me show you something real quick before y'all go away. No, 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 I no. I got to show them where we went to catch it, okay? No, can we record some more? Okay, I, we can, but let me show them where we had to go to get them. That was an ass. That's why I jumped out of the water. Okay, so now, we're a world champion now. Congratulations, Jazz. Okay, so we had to come on over here to the East Forest Rock. That's the first time I caught one on this coast here. Normally I catch yeah. them right in here or right in here. But you can catch them there too, obviously. Now we're going to back up and try to catch this one too. What do you think about that, Jazz? We caught one. We can catch another. No. What of? It's right there. But if we catch him, he'll be mad at us and we'll get in trouble. How will we get in trouble? Because, I'm not scared of that big fish. But we'll get in trouble. With who? My? With the fish. Oh, the fish can't do nothing but go in the aquarium. We're not going to eat them. We're just going to put them in the aquarium. Or we'll maybe we can break him. him and then catch him. We can break him. We got him, Jazz. Two in one day. See, when... He's close to the land, and that's nice to catch him in that area. You don't even have to go into the red here. You just let him start hitting into that into the land, and he's going to bounce right back. We're actually in a better position with this one than the last one. Because he's getting up to about 45 feet, and he's bouncing right back to us. So he's going to get tired probably faster than the last one, but we'll see. And I mean, just play with it, just like it, this right here. There's no sense in trying to lose the fish by going into the red. Then you're in danger of line will break. So it's keeping the green and the yellow right here. Now, if you're further up from the water, in the water, and it's going past 100 feet, then I get it to the yellow, orange, and red area. I keep the tension tight. Because then but you gotta line. make sure it doesn't turn blue. No, don't ever let it turn blue because then when the line will break, it's too much slack. Yeah. Not enough tension. It could break your line so quick. Yep. And a fish will get away. And that's frustrating. Because you did all the work to get the fish and then you lost it. Yeah. You gotta have but the right tools to catch it, but... If you don't have the right tools to catch it, then just ignore it and move on. You know what I really like about fishing game, though, is even when something like that happens, you might be frustrated for a minute, but you know you have another chance. You just come back and try again. And then you can catch it and you learn your lesson. You do it different next time. Yeah, but if you ever have trouble catching fish, always ask us. Yeah, you can ask on our on our uh, Facebook page. Facebook, not Facebook, on our uh, YouTube page, and we'll look, we'll show you how to do a video of how to catch that fish. Yeah, so we've been posting all of our YouTube videos. What does that even mean? Posting them? Yeah. It just means we put them on YouTube and they're public to view. Everybody can view them. He's starting to come in. He's gotten tired now. Yeah. So as long as you watch our fishing game. You'll learn how to um, how to catch all the fish. Now in the water, this fish actually looked bigger than the last one. We'll see. I, it could, could be not true. Yeah. It might actually be a bigger fish, but we'll see. Remember that Kirby movie? Yes. All right. Got another one. Two in one day. Nope, it wasn't bigger. It was actually much smaller. We didn't even get to see Kirby visit Prince Fluff and how King Diddy and what happened to King Diddy D. So now it's getting late. We're going to head back to the hotel. But you realize we did that from 4 p.m. until 8 p.m. Of four hours of game time, we caught two of those Cynarius. That was pretty good.
Ah, the elusive Pinaria. You actually caught one? You know, have, have no idea how hard these are to find. No, we're pretty well aware of that. They're kind of easy if you have the so right the tools. So the S ranking was 49,500 fishing points. A regular one, 16,500. We bad. got a right S. Points. Yes, we got an S and a C. All but right. do you get a right when you beat the game and get a lot of points? We got a world championship. Yeah. Did you see that? Yeah. So I wonder if we get any bonus stuff. We'll have to find out. We're running low on these, so let's go ahead and get some of these. Now that we just got all those points, we can spend some on Betty. Okay. Well, you want to look at the pictures? Yeah. Okay, so this is what you we normally do. You okay, haven't we gotta seen took the pictures, pictures when we took a, a fishing cruise, a submarine tour. That's what these are. Oh, and there's one of our guys with a bluefin tuna, I believe. That's what yeah. It looks like. Did we catch that yet? I believe this guy has caught it. What we're going to do now is go to our room. And at our room, we can, first of all, check and see how our fishing aquarium did today. So we were down 25 visitors from yesterday, but we made 13,000. We have a total of 13,334 visitors and 95,590 fishing points we got today. The boat. Our aquarium writing is okay, and our entry fee is okay. We're charging 110 uh, points per entry. They like our tropical freshwater fish, but they don't like our temperate saltwater. So we need to go to the ocean and do some trolling fishing probably. But the tank too is the medium size, so we need to catch some large fish in the, in the ocean. Okay, so we've seen that. Now what I like to do is... Come over to this. And in this, you can look at the fishing book. And we can see if there's any fish we haven't caught in this area. Canaan Lake is where we are. Okay, it looks like we got all on the first page of Canaan Lake. Oh, we're missing one right here. Yeah. Not sure if that's a muskie or what. That might be a muskie. We caught him. That was a high area. We just yeah. Two of them. I think that was a boss battle. Okay, and then the important thing to do is the extra fish. So we got Especially. one fish missing at this world. So we got to figure out which one it is and get it. Okay, this is another one that I believe comes from here. So we it's a special fish. We got a. It's probably one a password fish. So we need to catch it too. We caught the eel. We caught this one out of the cave. We caught this one out of uh, Tima Paradise. Not Tima, uh, the uh, Pekar Beach. This one's in Tima Paradise. This one's in the ocean. I think that's, we got two we haven't caught yet. So what I like to do is when I'm visiting a place is catch all the fish in that area. But I thank you for stopping by. This was another great adventure. We showed you how to catch the Hydaria today. Yeah, and we'll sh and tomorrow we'll show you how to catch that one fish that we're wow. missing at this world, and then we will. after school tomorrow. Yes, okay. after school that will be great. Tomorrow, right. remember tomorrow. All right. Well, we'll see you later. If you have any questions or want us to catch a different type of fish, please leave the comments on our video. Thank you. Bye. And we will post this video and goodbye.